Welcome to our ongoing Droid VPN settings tutorial series. Today, we're diving into a crucial topic, Droid VPN TCP and HTTP headers proxy settings. If you're new to this series, make sure to watch our first video on creating a Droid VPN account. And as always, if you find this tutorial helpful, remember to share, like, and subscribe. Step 1. Install Droid VPN. Start by downloading and installing Droid VPN from your mobile app store. Once it's installed, launch the app and you'll land on the home screen. Step 2. Accessing the menu. In the top left corner of the screen, you'll see a hamburger icon. Click on it to access the app's menu. Step 3. Setting up account. Inside the menu, you'll find the account option. Click there to set up your account settings. If you already have an account, log in using your username and password. If not, check out our previous video to create an account. Step 4. Accessing VPN Settings Now, let's delve into Droid VPN Settings. Click on Settings to access the different protocols. Step 5. Configuring TCP and HTTP Settings Within the Settings section, locate and click on TCP and HTTP to configure these settings. Step 6. Accessing Proxy Settings Before we dive into Proxy Settings, I'd like to note that we've already discussed TCP port and HTTP headers in previous videos. You can find those in our Droid VPN settings playlist. Today, our focus is on proxy settings. To use a proxy with TCP, click on Proxy Settings to continue. Step 7. Proxy Settings Overview In the Proxy Settings section, you'll find two options, one for a custom proxy and the other to use the VPN's built-in proxy server. Step 8 using the built-in proxy server. If you prefer to use the VPN's built-in server as a proxy, click the radio button to enable it and disable the custom proxy setting. Step 9. Configuring a custom proxy. If you want to use a custom proxy, click the radio button to enable it, as shown, and disable the built-in proxy server. Step 10. Proxy configuration without HTTP headers. Now, let's configure proxy settings without HTTP headers. In the Proxy Configuration section, input the valid proxy server and port to use it. If your proxy requires a username and password, input them in their respective fields for authorization. Step 11. Adding HTTP headers to the proxy. You can also add HTTP headers with your proxy. To do this, click on Proxy HTTP Headers, and a box will pop up. Input the valid headers and click Save. Step 12. Finalizing configuration. After configuring all these settings, go back to the main screen and click on the Start button to connect your VPN. Step 13. Explore more in our playlist. Remember, there's more to discover in our Droid VPN series. Check out our playlist for tutorials on TCP and HTTP headers, settings, and UDP settings. Conclusion. That concludes our guide on Droid VPN TCP and HTTP headers proxy settings. We hope this tutorial helps you customize your VPN experience. If you found this valuable, please support us by sharing this video, giving it a thumbs up, and subscribing for more useful insights. Thanks for watching.